Welcome to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we are gonna head through Diglett's Cave and finally res our little Omanite, because that's what we can do now. Since we got our little boy cut a last time, we're all good to go. So we're gonna head on down this way, pick up some shit from the Pokemon first, because that's how uh, we roll here. We need some thingies so we don't get caught by the good old repels. That which makes LPs go. Anyway, it's been a while since I recorded. A few days. Been watching a little too much, uh, too much of the World Cup, because that's kind of what I do. Anyhow, um, I still have not figured out what the hell we're gonna get our uh, our last Pokemon with, or what slot? Well, uh, you know what I'm saying. What 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 our last Pokemon is gonna be outside of Omanyte? Um. Good old little Omanyte will help us cover some things. I'm kind of leaning towards something like a Voltorb, which we get here later on, because you don't really see those too much. Um, it's fast as hell, which I kind of like that. Um, if I remember right, it should have pretty decent, um, uh, pretty decent special attack, I think. I'm not sure right off the top of my head. I'll probably go check in between this episode and the next one, just to... For, what the fuck, did, did I not use that? I fucking hate Doug Trio. Holy shit! I don't want, I don't, I don't want none of that. Oh, you fucking bastard. You're a fucking bastard. God damn it. It's a good thing it's Santa Nuzlocke, because this could seriously fuck our shit up. Like, bad. Oh, and I can't switch either with fucking an arena trap. God damn it. God damn it, damn it, damn it. Fuck it, we're just gonna set up on his ass, cause that's all we can do. Yeah, take take that, faggot. Anyway, so I had an interesting conversation with the girlfriend a few days ago. Um, we were talking about the YouTube culture. She watches uh, PewDiePie all the time. I'm sure you've uh, seen his shit. He's like fucking everywhere. But anyway, um, in case you haven't noticed, that whole YouTube culture thing, which it's true, there, there is a little fucking YouTube elitist prick culture out there where the uh, content creators are all a part of, and uh, the rest of us lowly serfs ain't, uh, ain't much worth of shit. And same with like the whole where how everyone views people as my fans, you know, and all that shit. Anyway, in case you haven't noticed, uh, we at the Ghost Key here just don't give no fucks at all. I don't really give a shit. If, like, I don't reply to your comments or something like that, it's not because I'm some little douchebag who has, doesn't have fucking time for you. It's literally because I don't know how to say thanks or some shit like that. Okay. Anyway, I don't know how to say, you know, thanks or comment without being awkward. Like, literally. I have I have issues like that. Like, somebody, you know, like, my first comment the other day said something to me and was like, Hey, good job. And I'm, it took me a while to respond just for the simple fact that I don't know how to say thanks and be gracious without being weird. Or at least I feel weird. I don't know if anyone else feels weird when I say shit like that, but I kind of do. But, you know, anyway, that's that's just that's just me and how I roll and shit. The fuck is that here anyway? You, you got anything in here for me? But, you know, like I said, I uh I just don't give no shits. Oh no. Fuck you. I don't want no Mr. Mime. We just don't give no shits here. I mean that's it if you know if I don't get to you, I apologize because they're not trying to be a douche. I just don't know how to fucking be not socially awkward. As if you couldn't tell already, which, you know, you're probably like, why the fuck are you doing LPs and if you're all worried about being awkward or you're all fucking awkward, you're supposed to sit here and entertain me and all this shit because I'm not really much. Like, I don't know. I, maybe I'm just too laid back for shit like that to, like, bother me because... Honestly, I just don't give no fucks at all. Wait, we're supposed to... Oh shit, did I come in the wrong way? I think I fucking did. Oh well, we'll just fucking take a look at this shit. 
Anyway, I, I just, you know, I'm not a funny person. I, I am socially awkward, and I know there's people out there who are like, oh, you know, you have to be all this shit, and I've watched a ton of those little YouTube videos where people are all about, you know, how good they are, and, and all the things you need to do to be a good Poketuber, and YouTuber, and all that stupid shit. I, I'm not into that. I'm not any of those things. In fact, I'm pretty much the the antithesis of everything that people believe should be, uh, you know, a YouTuber. I'm, I'm not funny. I'm not that entertaining. All that I really do is sit here and ramble in. And, and I know a lot of people who do this shit, you know, say that you gotta put in all this fucking hard work and you gotta do all this hard work to get where you are and to be all good and, you know, all this, all this sort of shit, which honestly you don't. It's not that hard to put together videos and, and shit like that. You just gotta have easy to use software at all honesty. That's really what it's about. Aha, yes. Take it to the Pokemon lab. Fuck, maybe I was lying earlier. We weren't resin this motherfucker, I was getting the amber, which that could be fun later. That could be a lot of fun. But anyway, we got that shit because... Ooh, alright, teach, teach somebody some seismic toss and shit. But anyway, I, I'm pretty much the opposite of that sort of shit, in case you haven't noticed. And quite honestly, I don't really care, and it's easy to do this sort of shit. It really is. Like I said, you just need some halfway decent equipment, and that's pretty much it. Um... Ooh. 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 I'm not sure what I want. Fuck it, we're not, we're not gonna take it for now. I'd rather keep it. Nope, fuck you. Anyhow, you know, like I said, in case you haven't noticed, we're, we're kind of not really into that sort of shit. We don't give no fucks, and it ain't that hard, as I said. You know I keep repeating myself here, and I just keep talking in circles and picking up this conversation where it was, and not really going anywhere, but truth is, this sort of shit isn't that hard to do. You just need halfway decent equipment, easy to use software, and honestly, anyone can do, anyone can do YouTube. I know I'm not anything special. I mean, I've got like a whole grand total of five subscribers right now, but I don't really care. It's you don't have to put that much hard work in it for it to be halfway decent. And I encourage people to, to go ahead and give it a try. I mean, you know, it's never gonna hurt to have more people playing Pokemon and games and shit like that on here because you know it's pretty awesome to sit here and play games and stuff and people care. Not that people care about my shit right now, but, you know, neither do we care. See, that's the beauty of it. Ain't no fucks being given here. But anyway, as I've said before, we don't care. I'll say that again, we just, we just don't fucking care. Alright, anyway, now that we've done that, we've got the old amber, we've got the omenite fossil, we're gonna start fucking some shit up over here. Um, I know a lot of people usually skip this sort of shit. And a lot of people don't like watching this sort of stuff, but I, it's, this is what I I enjoy. I enjoy these fights and shit like this. You know, I, I know I complain about like the SSN where they just kind of throw shit in there while you're trying to accomplish something. But you know, fights in between routes for some reason aren't aren't that bad. And it's also it's also nice to have kind of a field test and see like these Pokemon are kind of halfway decent. It's always nice to have a field test out here to be able to see where your Pokemon are and where they match up with just random shit. As I said before, I just wish you could do double battles more throughout the main main storyline of the game. Those are just so much fun. So much more intricate, I you know. Ooh, wing attack. Alright, what do we got? Whirlwind, Gust, Quick Attack. You are 40, you are 60. Bye bye, Gusticles. Ain't no God here. Anyhow, I am thinking about um, starting up Fear. In case you've never played it, it's an amazing FPS, and it's one of my favorites. I actually take that back. It is my favorite first-person shooter of all time. 
No, no one guy. Oh, he does just want to fight. Anyway, um, I love Borderlands a lot. That that game is a hell of a lot of fun. But Fear is my favorite one by far. I just I just enjoy the shit out of it and um, figured I'd play it because I haven't played it in a long time. In a long time, probably well over a year now. I haven't played through those games. I will not be playing Fear Three, even though I had it. that game was fucking shit. I don't even be started on that fucking whatever the fuck that was. God damn. I didn't sleep. But anyhow, um, the only way to play that game though is at night, so I kind of gotta wait for it to kind of go to go to sleep. I don't say go to sleep. Kind of go get dark outside, and then we can we can start playing that. But like I said, um, yeah, I'm gonna start recording some of that here soon. I'm still working on Football Manager. Ooh, horsey. Still working on Football Manager, but uh, that, that's looking like that's going to be pretty shitty quality regardless. Which really irritates me. Because it looks wonderful otherwise. But anyhow. Uh, okay, so I believe... Fuck, I don't even know. I gotta go check, see what we're doing storyline-wise after this place, because I don't really remember. I mean, that's kind of... That's kind of the good thing about this. Oh, yeah, we're... Uh, Rappel. It's kind of the good thing about uh, playing this the way I am right now is I'm not really going through and, and researching shit way too much. I'm just kind of figuring out what fucking route I need to go down. That's pretty much as far as I go looking ahead. And it's been a long time since I've played this game. So, yeah, shit's just kind of slowly coming back to me in really small, irrelevant pieces that no one really pays attention to, you know, like, some of the sprites and shit, but that's pretty much, pretty much it, I mean, hell, last time, you know, I didn't even fucking realize Dirt Machine fucking evolved when it did, yeah, speak of the devil, but anyway, um, yeah, the next episode will probably be a lot of this, and moving through the story, well, moving through the routes, not necessarily the storyline, because there's not really much going on out here. It's just fucking dirt machine running boss on these little bitches, and that's pretty much it. But anyhow, um, you're a little kid. Why don't you fight me? That's good. Ah, shit! Arr, in the grass, I raised my foot. Yeah, you sure did, buddy. Youngster Dave. I don't really wish they had more of like a like a league thing. Probably get into that a little bit more later in the game when we actually get close to the Pokemon League. Because like the way they call the Pokemon League and me being a sports person, and the way it is in this game, it's uh, it's it's weird. I, I don't really care for their interpretation of a Pokemon League. I mean, I don't know. Once again, just me being a sports douche and, and I'm just not I'm not really cool with the way they call it a league and, and stuff and shit and kick, oh shit there's a lot less than I thought but then again the dirt machine has a whole lot of fucking defense and shit at least physical anyway can't even stand up to no fucking average man. like fuck it I got Ravisaur did last time little fucker got rocked But if I remember right, if I remember right, ah, fuck, I don't, I don't even know, I don't even know if we're doing the, the, the fucking power plant yet, or what the fuck is next, I have no goddamn clue. Eh, Magnemite, look at you, oh shit, we don't want none of this, we don't want none of this, we don't want none, oh, let's go with the Granker, let him go out there and kick the shit out of him. Oh, that. Ah, oh, shit. Magnemite again, really? It's like, really? Magnemite? That's one thing I never really understood. Like, why people, like, why they just gave trainers, like, every Pokemon in an evolution line. It's, it's just, it's weird. It kind of goes against all the principles and you brought. 
this guy. It kind of goes against all the principles in, in Pokemon with type coverage and shit. And this guy. He brought this guy. Ah, I love Magneton. But anyway, it's... I don't know. It doesn't make fucking sense. I don't know. I wish they'd kind of change that. There's a lot of things that they just kind of do that's kind of like this... Uh, not really like algorithms or program, but it's just kind of like ingrained in the Pokemon DNA to have fucking trainers like this, which God knows why. I mean, they're kind of pointless. It's pretty much just, oh yeah, I just throw this guy out there. And it's not really challenging. It's, if you've got... If you've got one trump for, you know, that Pokemon, that type, then you just run those fuckers out the building. Good thing this is not a mess lock, because I just don't fucking care to use my items. See, that's something, <laughs> that's something I always did when I was, well, I still did it to this day, but... I still hoard the shit out of my uh, my healing items. I don't, I don't know why. Like I'm saving them for a fucking doomsday or some shit. Like the world's gonna go down and I'm gonna need that fucking one poison heal or some shit. But anyway, that's it for this episode. We really didn't get far. Um, we just went and grabbed some old amber and I rambled on a little bit. And we started on, was that Route 11 back there? Um, but anyway. That's that's what we're gonna pick up next time. Hopefully clear the rest of that, get to the next town, whatever the fuck it may be. I don't even know. I probably should look at the map, but I'm not going to. Anyhow, pants are optional, shit's getting awkward, weird, I've been talking for way too long, so see ya. And uh, do that whole thanks for watching and, and subscribing thing and and you know, the whole YouTube here we are, we know what we're doing and, and shit and awkward.